All right, so I was debating if I should have some cringy introduction here or not, so I'm just not going to because I'm not cringy like that. All right, welcome to the introduction for the NSA Server Nexus database, that thingy that we're going to be using for tracking all of your guys' careers. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, Start out here. This is My Career. You can use it by hitting the My Career tab up on your screen up here. Um... By choosing this, you can see how many, how much FP you have, any logs that you were given, which may or may not include suspensions, trainings, patrols, operations, projects, so on and so forth. Uh, when your career is first added, you're automatically going to be set to the amount of FP that you had for that rank, so you don't got to worry about getting it made up. Just going to automatically add it. Uh, high ranks, Chief of Staff Plus, have the option to delete logs off of your career if like uh, it's deemed that you didn't deserve the FP or something like that. Um, soon enough you guys are going to be able, or HICOM is going to be able to mark your career as a priority to get you kicked out, suspended, so on and so forth. Let's use the search feature now. So uh, let's pull up, says his career, the beloved deputy director. If you pull up his career you'll also see he has maxed out FP It'll show the next rank that you're applicable for, for promotion, what the requirements are for that, his logs, his rank, his career, his profile picture. You're soon going to be able to see in here uh, your person's division, hopefully. We'll, we'll see about that. Uh, let's go to an agent's career. Let's go to B-Bart's. All right, so as you can see, he has 30 FP right now. He's an agent. His next rank is field agent. He needs to attend events to earn a total of 95, which is the promotion requirement for uh, to field agent. So once he gets that, he'll appear on a administrative staff plus's task list for promotion, and that'll be done. Let's go to another agent's career. A fast John X, or let's go to a person who's suspended right now. Well, let me check. Uh, Mark Blade. Let's go to his career. I'm not sure if General promoted him yet or not. Okay, so he's back at Pro B. Okay, so he doesn't, he has no FP right now, as you can see. He has zero FP, and uh, his next rank is agent. He needs to attain 30 FP to get promoted to agent, appear on the task list. Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. I need to check this out, because that's weird. Okay. We're just going to move on from that. Um, the information is basically the lore to the place. Um, the place has a little bit of lore. This was originally made for a war clan. Never used it, so we just moved on. The change log is basically all of the many changes that our lovely coder back has done during the time. This is the high comms tools. I'm going to give you guys an insight. So this is the standard task list. If someone was due for a promotion, the task would appear here for high comm to be able to take and promote them. Batch log editor allows people to, or allows high comm to add logs for people. They, it's just, it's basically this. And then they choose whatever type of log, enter someone's username. So let's see, says as with 5 FP for a patrol. That'll get added create the batch log. Then I'll go over to his career. He has 555 FP now, so I'm going to delete that log because that shouldn't be there. And that's basically the introduction to what the NSA data center is now. So... It, it basically replaced our old Trello board that we had, that personnel management ran, that was slowly becoming obsolete, so we just decided to do this. Thanks for uh, thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, feel free to contact a senior command member and ask them. Thank you!